Day two here at Cowboy Up at the Axie Bowl. Um, we had a super fun little flight yesterday and today looks much better. It's about one o'clock now. They're just about to get ready to tow. So they set a little 55 kilometer task for the open class and sorry, it's 75 for the open class and it's 50 for the sports class. And we just stay on the same line, so we're just gonna fly with the sport class guys and try to get them along the course. And then uh, when we come back here to the airport, we just keep going to the north a little further and then come back here. Yeah, let's talk to some sport class pilots here. Here we got the Falcon crew. Falcon crew. Falcon crew. Are we gonna break some personal bests today? Uh, we're gonna demolish personal bests ah. today. Yeah, I love that. Yes. You ready? Woo! It's gonna, I don't do this very often, uh, but today's forecast is gonna be primo bitchin'. So, just so you know. Primo bitchin'. Yeah. I primo, like that. Primo bitchin'. 10 out of 10, primo bitching. Guaranteed. Nice. South Texas, Texas, South Texas soaring at its finest today. Go fly to gold today. Same thing here? I hope so. We're gonna give it a shot. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Okay. Clouds and birds. I Clouds and birds. Here we got another falcon. Hi. Ready to go fly? Yes, I am. You gonna fly the task? No. No. <laughs> I won't. No, I'm an H2. <laughs> Okay, but you got a beautiful looking glider there. Thank you. I think all gliders should be like this, right? All right, man, have a good one. Thank you. Same thing to Dave. Yes, sir, Wolfie. We'll see have you up fun. there. fun. Que pasa? Que pasa, Fredo? Let's do it, man. All right, Dave in the Falcon 145. Here he goes. How does that work again? Can you tell me that it's again? It's a zigzag line. It's totally obvious. What is zigzag? It's a line, but in zig and zag and back and forth line. It is so super easy to understand. Uh, not for me. <laughs> Definitely not for me. All right. You ready to fly high? Ch fun. XC Bowl day two. I'm ready to fly high. Well, that was fun, but unfortunately we are six kilometers short. So it was a super fun flight. I don't know, two hours or something in the air. 
Um, unfortunately, Zach and I landed 6k short of the airport. We came over here, turn points just over there, and um, it's all shaded in here. And we glided from about 15k's out from cloud base and never really got anything again to turn in. And yeah, nice muddy field next to the road. Now break down the glider and hopefully Tyler comes and picks us up. 2,000 years later. There's a ride! About 100% chance I'm going to jail in Texas. <laughs> <laughs> I'm too pretty for that! <laughs> nothing, nothing. Yeah. We kept pushing more downwind and there was nothing, nothing, well, at nothing. At the turn point was lift. Nothing. At the turn point nothing. was lift. Nothing. Well, on the right side. It, it was shaded in, we had nothing there. And then we flew it was shaded in by a big cloud. Yeah. That was hoovering up the air around it. <laughs> <laughs> nothing. Well, I was about to turn around about two k's before the turn because I figured I'm not going to make it. And now I can make it back to the airport. Then I realized, well, so if, I, turned if I... Before making the turn point I, even. And I still didn't make it. I did not. I, I, I was thinking about that. But then I realized if I make it back and Sack does too, then I'm just going to get a lot of shit for turning around two k's too early. <laughs> you should not gonna, like, We're not going to get up. We're not going to get up. And then I was like, so where are we going to land? And Sack was below me. I was like... Just pick a field where I can land bare feet. Just pick a field where I can land bare feet. You gotta oh, be you would have you would have not wanted to land in the fucking corn stalks that we landed in, dude. Those <laughs> yeah. things would have gone right through those feet. Tomorrow. Hey, so that's it from the XC Bowl and Cowboy up. Uh, as you guys can see, it's a booming flying day today. But unfortunately, we have to drive back to California. We got a 26 hour drive back and Dave and Alfredo have to go back to work. So let's go back and make some hang gliders. Dude. Let's go back and make some hang gliders. But it does hurt leaving with yeah. the sky like that. Yeah, huh? I know, I know. I don't want to even see it this time. Well, we're going to see it all day. But anyway, thanks Bart. Thanks for coming. Thanks Tiki. Thank you dear. We'll see you guys next year again. Next year. Here we got Ben the locksmith. Fun yeah. flight. <laughs> There's the only child here really is Dustin. Yeah. With the biggest mouth. <laughs> All right. Oh man. Yeah. Fun flying with you? Amazing, dude. So fun. So new personal best today? Uh, yesterday. So I'm going to smash that today. You're going to smash that today? Yep, 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 yep. Okay, so I'm going to get a little short phone video when you smash your bros mode best, right? All right, yeah, so yeah, I can yeah. put it in a vlog? Yeah, as soon as I land. Okay, look at that. Right yeah. now, guys, he's personal best. Here we are. I just landed out from uh, Wharton Regional Airport, XC Bowl Task 3. Landed in this nice, beautiful field. Really, really fun day. Uh, I did not make my personal best, unfortunately. Um, actually, I didn't even hear my very own beep one time. I just launched. fun um, yeah uh, this is just the beginning of my XC career uh, you guys will see me going real far someday so until then you guys have a good one Tyson Taylor fun flying with this dude what a great what a great weekend it was awesome thank you for being for so humble coming down here all you guys driving all the way cross country to do this it's freaking awesome it was awesome it's cool flying with you guys and I'm gonna put a link in the description of his video, so check that out. Yee. Got them stressors. Worst hang glider pilot in the world. Number one. guys I have to add something on to that vlog we're about two hours out of Phoenix uh, somewhere in the National Forest and finally the Sun came out we had a pretty uncomfortable night driving uh, the heaters broken in that car 
and it was I think it was minus one degree Celsius with this something like what is it? Minus 30, 30 30 degrees Fahrenheit. It was freezing. So we all wearing sleeping bags and I'm driving with a sleeping bag and the boys have a couple of blankets. It's freaking cold in here. It was freaking cold all night. It's so freaking cold. Pretty comfortable drive, but we are about what is it, five, six, seven hours out of LA? Yeah, that was that. So that to say that. Um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the last video. We had a good time at Cowboy Up. If you do, give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe and press the notification bell. There's gonna be more cool videos pretty soon. So see you guys in the sky soon. Thank you.